Hello everyone, Z Corey, and welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be using a beautiful butter gun. Um, here we have the gold AM17 with us. Wait, let me do that again for that thumbnail, the quick, easy thumbnail. Um, this gun is actually, well, you guys uh, have seen me use the AM17 before, and we all know how much of an amazing weapon it is, so I'm sure this gun is going to be um, just as amazing, if not better, than its normal counterpart. I, I have not played Warface in a little bit, in a good minute, so I am getting my keybinds and everything wrong, and is feeling a bit awkward, but uh, let's see if we can hamper these guys progress here. Okay, we immediately sort of miss our target there, and getting all the headshots, as you can see. <laughs> um, but this gun, nothing to say about it, honestly. Nothing to say about it that's not already known. I mean, <laughs> AM17 GG. <laughs> um, yeah, this gun's pretty much the strongest or the second strongest now that the AMB17 is out. Uh, SMG in the game. Uh, they have us undercover there. Not undercover, but under target there. From mid. Um, let me just flank them. We have a good team composition here. A few nurses on our team to tend to our, I'm sure, many wounds. Uh, to the many wounds that I'm sure we'll have, is what I'm trying to say with my broken English. Um, where is he? Oh, he gets us with the Uzi Pro. Uh, it's so weird when people like move back like that, just very slowly. <laughs> it's like, damn, that's some like next level movements. DSL movements movement uh, tips and tricks um, but yeah this gun actually looks hella dope too in, in gold like um, I've said this before too but old gold camos were like all boring and shit but now that they have designs and patterns like this they're making them pretty well honestly let me put this in escape oh, oh. my team is very vigilant and, and on point here too like, know when to push, know where to go. Oh my god. <laughs> I was gonna be close. <laughs> oh my god, this team. Price is having a meltdown. <laughs> he doesn't know what to do. I'm gonna switch to his uh, custom scope too here. Uh, it's it's an interesting scope. It's, it's both good and bad. Like, it depends a little bit on your player style. Um, a little bit also on your preferences and aiming abilities like but uh, red dot stays a classic and and competes with it very nicely obviously uh, there's one more there no <laughs> spit all my bullets pre-firing him <laughs> but he never stepped out oh is that nurse gonna get us oh <gasps> yes yes oh my god nurse best job in the world or most appreciated job in the world <laughs> what am i saying um let's see if we can this is gonna be a quick game it seems so uh actually not so but we're gonna follow up with an ffa as usual uh for you to see how it does and everything uh i'm gonna put the silencer here too i actually do like the silencer a little bit like if you guys remember from my am17 normal am17 video I said that my preferred setup is with the silencer, but you are going to get a lot of tanks with, uh, if you do go with that setup. So, uh, what I'm thinking is that maybe the, if this gun has increased damage, because it's gold, the, um, having a silencer on it might not be as much of an issue, you know? Oh god, me. Ooh, we just, it's just me and a nurse here. It's a bit hard. Did our teammate die? No, our teammate's alive. Ooh. I was like, where the hell is this guy? Like, <laughs> he's just sitting there. <laughs> Top notch choices in decision making. Um, this is a solid team, actually. Well, it's kind of like one of those annoying team comps or, or combinations. 
three medics and like whatever else. If it was two snipers, it would have been like the epitome of cancer, but <laughs> two NGs, so it's a bit less cancerous, I guess you could say. Um, okay, our teammates are just going in here. Just plant a nade, plant a nade here. Yes. Oh, damn! One of them even left. It's not very. It's not a lot of sportsmanship. You know. I'm hearing noises, but I can't tell where they are from. Damn, I feel bad for that guy. I don't know if he missed his shots or or what, but oh god, don't scare me like that, teammate. What's his name? <laughs> Mates, don't scare me like that. Okay, pretty quick game. I don't know how long that lasted, but we're gonna jump straight into uh, an FFA, and hopefully that goes a bit more uh, well. It'll be longer, hopefully, and you'll be able to see this gun a bit more, like, in a competitive uh, <laughs> scenario, because I'll be facing, like, AMB-17s and AK-12s and such, so I'll be right back. Okay, boys and girls, we're back for round two on the brand new, um, I was gonna say motel, uh, but this is obviously not motel, the brand new, uh, how... These spawns, gosh. I was gonna say these spawns are good, but I guess they're not so good. Uh, the brand new Yard uh, FFA, and if I'm being honest, this FFA is, this map is better, this map's FFA is better than, um, the, better than actual traditional FFA maps, and it's pretty goddamn funny if that's the case. And a bit sad too at the same time. Uh, we're getting a lot of, I think, Damn, that guy drop shot him, my man. <laughs> uh, but as I was saying, this map is actually, like, honestly, it's super good. Like, the FFA on this map is really good because the spawns are, are way higher quality than, um, at least from my one game playing so far on this map. <laughs> the spawns are much higher, much better uh, positioned than, and um, plan than they are in traditional FFA, uh, maps, which is a little weird, I'm gonna be honest, and I think that they should take note on their own work, I don't know how that would work, but they should, somebody is there behind me, 100%, um, let's see if they come for me, it's this goddamn sniper, uh, but we got a full lobby here, and it's there's a lot of time left, so hopefully you can you guys can see this gun in action properly and well. Um, let's also switch the attachments up here, so you guys can uh, take a look at how it does with different setups. Put its own and with the red dots, and this should be good. We're still in the lead, but not by a lot of points, so we need to like sort of secure our place here at the top If I care about winning, which honestly At this point in time, I'm so washed that I don't think I even should care about winning anymore and we're getting um, The FFA win achievements. That's somebody still behind me. Not still, but that is somebody behind. Oh, I guess they weren't behind me and they just spawned Is that a guy there? Oh Okay, I just <laughs> Come on, Yard, I just said good stuff about your spawns. Don't give me that. No. Hip fire, the power of hip fire. Stay with me. Okay, now we have a 1,000 point lead. A little bit better. Well, a lot better. But still not enough to slack off. This immortal guy. There's always, like, one sniper in, in these FFA games that, like, haunts me in my dreams and nightmares. And... On the toilet seat and they just never let go they never stop the chase the hunt uh oh is that somebody heard the car come smg i think who dares use my baby in, in my presence this sounds a little weird use my baby oh <laughs> uh, no my own commentary i'm pointing out the flaws in my own commentary he's above me oh no can you even get above on on top there in this F in the FFA version? I don't know if you can. 
Actually, I think since now they're going for like uh, lack of uh, verticality in, in in FFA maps at the very least, it shouldn't be like that. If I'm guess, if I were to guess, oh, what are these? No, <laughs> I just can't. Uh, what's it called? I can't hit fire with with um. Wow. Really gonna drop shot me like that, buddy. Uh, what was I talking about? Oh, I can't t cut them uh, one tap heads with the R8. I don't know what it is. I just jumped in front of that guy immediately. <laughs> oh, that was bad. Uh, but yeah, like I said, this honestly great map design for the FFA here. You see, again. I can't do it with the R8. I love the R8 pistol, but we're just not made for each other, I guess. I'm only faithful to the M9A1, it seems. <laughs> Please make it a gold M9A1. <laughs> I'll do anything to get it. Actually, isn't the winter M9A1 pretty good, too? Like, maybe I should try to get my hands on it somehow. Um, I don't know how I would do that, but... Maybe I, I could do that and get a little bit of a better performance and and not be at a total disadvantage when I use the M91, you know? There was somebody here that... Okay, another said. Oh, sounds. Noises. Oh. Somebody's here. No, R8, R8, why you do this to me? <laughs> it's again, oh, somebody's died here. Oh no, my kill. No, <laughs> I was gonna knife him. <laughs> was that disrespectful? Is that why it died that way? Oh, somebody nearby. Okay, yeah. Oh, same guy killed me again. Holy shit, it's like the universe is sending a message teaching me a lesson about respect and, and um, I don't know what other lessons the universe would be teaching me here, but No, can you get headshotted mate? Okay, who lived here? <laughs> I don't know why I got so surprised when that guy walked out there <laughs> With the helmet and his armor, like, he's, he looks so weird. Bro, how am I not killing anyone? Is it this silencer? It's like, making me tickle people. Got a tickle machine here. Thanks to this... Silencer, it seems. They, yeah, they honestly did a real good job um, designing the FFA version of this map. Kudos to... Did somebody just... Somebody's behind me somehow, I think. That was bad. Uh, <laughs> bad choice of movement and timing. If that makes any sense. Oh. So he's close by. Got him. Oh. No! <laughs> Oh, you guys saw nothing, okay? You saw nothing. Anyone says anything about that, I will delete the universe. Don't dare me, I will do it. <gasps> Why are these random nades? <laughs> oh shit. I guess that's what I get from that easy miss on that guy. Oh? Oh? Oh, he came to my, came directly for my warm embrace. There. Oh no. Same guy. Oh. Ooh, how many was that? That was. There's no way that was seven kills. I thought maybe you could get a combo kill there. Oh. Ah, shit, again, we missed that. Our 8th shot at the end. 
Okay, I thought that guy was so oblivious that he didn't come back for me. But I guess there's still hope. <laughs> Why is that guy spamming his, <laughs> his fucking crouch button? Oh, holy shit. Ah, uh, don't go away, my prey. Oh, they killed him. Is somebody following me? Oh my god, yeah. Though, are eight? I'm like cursed when I, as far as the R8 goes, I'm bound to miss 90% of my shots or my headshots, I should say, when I use the the gun, I guess, the pistol. Um. Anyways, guys, I hope that was a bit more uh, auction packed, so you guys could see the M17 in all its glory. Uh, again, nothing to be said that isn't known about this gun is is honestly quite amazing and and uh the second best if not the best i think the aims b17 is uh both on paper and subjectively no yeah well no those are yeah that would be that it would be that <laughs> gosh i can't speak both objectively and subjectively uh better than the aim 17 i think it has like yeah, because it has like hired everything, if I'm not mistaken. The only difference though, the only like thing you could say the AM-17 has going for it over the AMB-17 is that um, you have options when it comes to the muzzle. You're not forced to use a silencer. Um, so let's see if we can just take a quick look at its stats here for a quick... Um, for a quick look around. Wait, let's compare the normal one first and then to the AMB-17, okay? So normal, compared to the normal one, it has 10 more RPM and two more bullets. So really the RPM is the only thing that matters. And if we compare it to the AMB-17, let's see if perhaps this gun is above the AMB-17. Ooh, okay, it gets close to it. So the AMB-17 has, uh, what is that? 25 more RPM than the AM17? So it has only 15 more than the gold one. Uh, but it has um, less hip accuracy and fewer bullets. Fewer, uh, small clip size, I should say. Um, so yeah, the gold AM17, as you would expect, falls between the AMB17 and the normal AM17. But anyways, guys, that's it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, if you want more with this gun or any other suggestions, feedback, anything, let me know in the comments. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.